Brandon. I'm, I, I, this is the game. I think they just jump right into it. Martian Magic versus Stick Boy over here. Martian Magic would immediately just had an accidental SD. Super unfortunate to start off with. Stick Boy is using crazy laser pressure over here. He's really trapping him back there. I keep being confused where, like, I see the chat say there's, like, the same nine viewers, but then I look at who's in it, and there's, like, 16 people, and I have no idea. It's, like, it throw me off. I don't know who to reintroduce to or who to. Oh, interesting. So... Marsh, regardless of that intro, he's starting to like cook up, cook a little bit more though. He's not giving up on this. Good forward tilt, and that's definitely gonna close out the stock. Oh, fantastic! Velo's trying to get people with a circle on the on the camera. He's like telling people to look up. So we have, you might you can actually kind of see one on the player cam right now. You can see up in the top right. You can see the stream on the stream. Interestingly enough, there's a some TVs around the venue that show the event as well, so you can see it from around the whole building. It's actually very cool. It's not actually a big a big store, um, but I I'm so thankful they let us come here. I think it's a really good environment. It's nice to get people who are like. Obviously, people are out like Sherwood. It's a little further from like a lot of the Portland Metro, but I also like I started playing this game out here. It's where I used to go, like three years ago when I started playing, like all the time to play. Um, so it, it once was popping and could be again. Stick boy takes game one. Um, <laughs> people joking aside, behind us, Stick boy uh, might might be a favorite to win. Just because we know that he like I don't know he probably has a good chance of winning. He's been playing with us specifically for a little while at like my house fests and stuff, picking up a lot of info. Switched to Falco recently, and it's been really positive for him. He played a menagerie of characters before, including Marth, Doctor Mario, and kind of Chibuka. But we do see that accidental SD. However, once again, it's kind of a justice SD because Martian had to work with it last time. I don't, I don't know. I think a big thing about those like early SDs like that is it's something like, it's really not that catastrophic, right? Like we saw last game like Stick Boy 2 stocked him. So regardless of that SD happening, it like theoretically, I know it doesn't work that way, but it's like, oh, it's technically the same. Ooh, that was a good, good F smash. Looks like it was a reaction to the roll. He had time to like react to it, it looked like for sure. Um, but those early SDs, like it's, it's like a mind over matter situation where it's like, if you just overcome it, don't worry about it. You can just perform as well. Your stocks are just a resource, and sometimes they get spent early. Sometimes you gotta spend them late. Ooh, that was interesting. Crouch canceling into a shine in there. I wonder if he was expecting to cancel it. Up tilts. Oh yes. So Stick Boy is introducing everybody to 2018, where we're out here and we're up tilting. Ooh, fantastic neutral tech. He saw him already committing to like diving over him. Oh, and these up airs, though, they're super threatening for platforms that Martian Magic is throwing out. A lot of short hop up airs that just really safely cover platforms. Oh, he's still trying to get him. Oh! And they're Ronnie. I feel like that's like Martian Magic's signature move at this point, because I've seen him do a couple of them where he, like, has a feeling which direction you're going to go. He just short hops over there and he throws it out. And they're not random, because he's, like, he tried, he's making educated guesses. I'm amazed. He would have made that with or without Randall, like, or at least he would have had the options, but he de like, having it available to him was a nice bonus. Ooh. Stick Boy's gotta make some magic happen right here. 
Hmm? Oh my god, that trade. I'm surprised it worked out like that. Yeah, me too. Surprised it was a so it turned out to be a game. Um, so it's okay. I, I don't, I'm not mad that you're asking, but the bracket link is literally on the layout. It's the only text that is not names or logo. That's funny. <laughs> Mustache. It's right. Yeah, it's challenge AGBG2. So Martian does take that one. Uh, the tides, the this. tides of war were a little different on that one. We had stick boy with the SD right off the bat. Kind of in payment for game one. Martian magic, I believe, was in the amateur bracket of my house tournament and did really well. Yeah, that's. I was saying he had a different he tag. That was, no, he did not. Uh, like hours. A couple, yeah, there's a couple. So I would just do that and then come to the house. Yeah, that's okay. Right. I'll just come okay. 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 Ooh, Martian is really making some grabs happen here. Oh my god, that short hop back was fantastic. I was uh, teaching stick some stuff in the past like he's, four days. He's really evolved, it looks like, like. Yeah, I was going to say, it seems like he's implemented some of it. I am. Um, his lasers are really tight. Like that short hop backer he just did out of shield was a reverse short hop back. Oh my god. It didn't it took me until I had a watch stick with it. Oh, you're on mobile, so it's hard to see. Yeah, so it is challenge.com slash A G B G two. Ain't gotta be good too. Of course. I actually I was playing with stick boy over at Egg's house and I didn't. I was playing him a bunch, and I couldn't really figure out like what was going on, right? Mm -hmm. And then I watched him play against Paps, who was a Marth player. That's yeah. Time. And I realized like there was just like a couple of things he was doing like barely wrong. And now that I'm seeing him implement it, he's doing a lot better. Oh, oh my god, that was such a tense situation. Like he wasn't. Oh my, he wasn't. He wasn't Bella, laser grabbing, and he wasn't uh, fast falling before his aerials came out. And now that I'm seeing him do more of both of those things. Mm -hmm. it, he's doing really well. Like, That's I think fantastic. Stick Boy a few days ago would be doing significant reverses with him. That's crazy. But he's playing really well. He's made huge strikes. They are yeah, back to even now after I say that, but he's made huge strikes. Like, it's like every couple weeks, it's like some big boost comes out. I would say that Martian Magic has also made huge strikes, though. The thing is, from Dracula. See, the thing is, I can't say that because I don't know. I just don't know who's played that well, right? I, just, I didn't even know who he played before. I remember he, he, he showed up. I remember the guy. He showed up. I, just, uh, I didn't really see him play, but I I knew that he did well in the amateur bracket, but not great. And now he's like this far. Yeah. So that makes me think that. You know what I mean? Yeah. What's kind of funny, oh the more and more I think about this point. tournament, and maybe just the way I should phrase it, like for helping some people sometimes, it's like this tournament, it's like it's an, it's a full sized amateur bracket. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's, it's a like full size amateur bracket. I wouldn't let people who place well. It's like, but if you're like going to stuff, and you're not like, yeah, you don't go to a whole lot, and you're not getting a whole lot better all at once. So this is not. That was nice. Oh. The thing was that soft bear actually like lined up better because had yeah, he gotten the hard one, he would have been in an awkward angle where he has like a oh, lot yeah. of recovery choices. That's for sure. Okay, last stop. Can't let him kill her. Really. Yeah. We'll see how this goes. This is really just about who holds it together, guy. <laughs> I think. I know, right? It's like the skill you're testing right now isn't isn't combo, isn't the guy. I think it's just composure. The stick is very patient, though, but he might get blown up. So we'll see how this goes. He's not giving up on the lasers. No, he's not. I think that's exactly what he needs to be doing. Okay. Oh, right back into it. the game plan that he's been using this whole time. Almost. Ooh, oh this is tense. It is. Oh, that's a missed way back. That's not gonna do it yet. Yeah, that's good. That might. Oh! My god. That's a finale. That was an amazing set. Interestingly enough, we also see the exact same uh, closure to that set that like that I was calling out. We're seeing a lot of these raw knees like call out like movement yeah. and getting a lot of payoff for it. Like when you're yeah. right next to him and you have to make a choice, no he's using that sort of situation if I'm to honest, make a lot happen. If I'm going to be 100% honest, I think that this is not the only set we're going to be seeing between these two You think players. that's going to just be the, ne the next that's one just in? That's going to be grand finals, dude. I think so. I really think so. You think so too? I don't think that. I, I don't. I'm not for sure yet. I don't know. I think it comes down to Stick Boy being able to beat Calder again or not. But I think Stick Boy did a lot of uh, good adaptations. Okay, he has to go through two Marths, but I think he did a lot of good adaptation in the last set he had with the Marth. And I think okay. he'll be able to get warmed up against Sloth and be able to clutch that one out and then be able to beat the other guy because he's warmed up against them. 